God damn, dude. That, <laughs> it's loud in my headphones, though. It's very orange as well. There we go. I'm just got to turn it down just, just a wee bit. Just just a little bit. There we go. It's a very trippy way. Whoa, what? <laughs> What's with all the, like, fucked up teddy bears, man? What? <laughs> also, hello to YouTubes and stuff like that. Bro, I need to play through the first one at some point. Whether it's on my own time, on stream, whatever. I just need to play through it. I also need to, like, go back and actually watch the anime. I watched a lot of it when I was a kid, but I don't remember if I ever, like, saw the whole thing or not. I started to when I was, like, late teens, but I never finished it, I don't think. Pretty sure I didn't. Is that the whole intro? Sounds like the whole intro. Okay. Dot hack mutation. Let's go. Uh... Convert. I'm assuming that takes, like, our save from the first one. But I don't know if it has to be, like, a completed save. That would make sense. But I have no idea. Sound. That's all fine. Voiceover. We have Japanese option. That's cool. Controller. Vibrate me. Yes, Daddy. Thank you. Uh, okay. Okay. Nothing. New game. Let's see how it works when you don't bring your save over. Registration process for the world is finished. Sorry, I was just looking at the uh, at the case. Dot hack dot com. I wonder if hack was a uh, top level domain back then, because it would have been cool if they could have just got like the dot hack. But I guess it would have had to been like dot dot hack, because <laughs> dot hack would have been the domain page itself. Anyways, okay, whatever. Reconfirming your name and character name. Uh, username. We are stream, and our character is kite. Lost connection for a minute? How dare you, my guy? Unmod you now. No, uh, <laughs> you probably missed when I said then. If you're not doing anything on, say, Monday, if you want to come and get the chair at some point, that would the be day that he first played excellent. The world. Oh, that drink lasts long. Orca fell into a deep coma as a result of Skate's data drain. The world isn't just an online game. Something with another purpose is lurking within it. Uh, possible spoilers for the first game, I guess? The Book of Twilight, handed to him by the girl Aura, transformed into a bracelet giving him two extraordinary powers. Data Drain, the power to alter monster data. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, keep going. And? And Gate Hacking, which allows him to gain entrance into protected areas. I don't think we unlocked that whenever we were playing. Same powers that put Orca into a coma. I want to help Orca. With the help of the bracelet, he and his party succeeded in destroying Skaith. However, hey, we did it. I don't know who the fuck Skaith is, but we did it. That must have been, like, the big bad from the first game. Bro, is that, like, a beating heart? That was a fucked up face. Ooh, you don't look nice. Interesting design, though. The whole... <laughs> we done got fucked up, bro. Wait, 
Wait, did we die? <laughs> we <have come> so <laughs> what? The, wait, what? So I'm so lost from not having like actually played through the first game, man. What is going now, on? The true battle was about to begin. Wait, isn't there like four of these games though? So is this really the true battle? Like, <laughs> I'm pretty sure the true battle is probably going to be in the fourth one, if I had to guess. Also, do we get subtitles, or is that just not an option here? Uh, news. All kinds of news. Holy shit, dude. International Geographic discontinued? Game coma impossible, says Professor. Uh, is it though? Public phone. Bigfoot investigation. Today, a massive Bigfoot investigation began in the suburbs. Bruh. The suburbs? Suburbs of Redding, Oregon, in response to many recent alleged sightings of the creature. City officials hope the investigation will revive interest in area tourism, although attempts to capture such a creature have been so far unsuccessful. City officials were pleased at the huge crowds that gathered at a barbecue party thrown for the would-be hunting party. I can't read. Scientists called it a new apple! Bruh, I like apples. Uh, I don't eat them because they hurt my belly, but... 0.49% error rate? The sound recognition device has evolved to near perfection with a less than 0.5% error rate when switched to chat mode. Recognizes the pauses by the speaker and translates them as dot 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 dot. The day may come when keyboards are obsolete. Is this just like the news from the first one? Because a lot of that news looks familiar. Holy shit, dude. Is this all of the mail from the first one too? See, like, okay, so some major spoilers potentially then. Like, I thought once we got this thing with the red wand, everything would be solved. It was baseless, but I thought everything would be back to normal. What did we do? Was what we did right? I'm not wrong, right? I hope so. <laughs> There's no point in being negative about it. Let's just believe in ourselves. Sure. <laughs> I don't know. The world. Let's just log in, man. I wonder, like, how this is going to be any different. Are we going to have, like, levels or anything? Virus Orca, increasing levels. Miss Gardenia Fan Club? Network Safety Law? I'm all for reform of the network safety law. You can't just kill someone because they just created some computer virus. Wait, what? I'm against reform. You can't say it's just a computer virus. People did die from it, you know? We know the dangers of cyber terrorism from Pluto's Kiss and Deadly Flash. I'm against cheap reform. I don't think it matters if they reform it or not. Ultimate is a perfect OS, right? You don't have to worry about cyber terrorism or a computer virus. Mm. Is it though? Welcome to version 2.75. Wait. Welcome to version 2.90. A new feature has been added to the 2.90X upgrade. We will explain it in detail in the post below. Flag race will be held in each of the towns where contestants will ride the grunties that they have raised and grab the flags in the town. To participate, raise all three types of grunties that are available in each town. When you have finished, you will receive an email regarding the flag race. Please proceed according to that email. Okay. International Geographic to continue, discontinued. A hundred year old liberal arts magazine, but I didn't know about it at all. But I guess it's the times. You can get comics online as well. Comics? What's comics got to do with National Geographic? International Geographic. My bad. My dad was solemnly listening to the news. Apparently, he was a liberal arts major and wanted to become an author. That was a side of my dad I've never seen before. Uh, I don't care. Log in. <laughs> Let's go, dude. You don't know who, but the slow feeder didn't work for someone tonight? Awesome. Or they just got into something they shouldn't have because our cats are terrible. Highland City. Okay, let's go. So this is the second town I think you can unlock in the first game. If I remember correctly, I have been here before because I got farther in the game when I played it when I was younger than I did when we were just trying it out for the gauntlet recently. So like, I do remember this city and those things walking around all over the place. Those are the grunties. Those are the things they were talking about raising. We are going to the dungeon of Theta, chosen hopeless nothingness to find out what happened. Bro, they didn't even try to lip sync, did they? Her lips didn't Feels move at all. Like this. <laughs> They're really not. Okay, well. Well, I guess we're in a party with her. What are? What do we have? So we have some basic stuff. We have data drain, of course. Do we have any items or anything? 
Just a bunch of basic secret magical defense parameter plus two. Ah, cool. Pyro's diary. Magical attack parameter minus one. That sounds bad. Why would we want that? Okay, we have a virus score, some event items. We're level 30 starting out. Um, our weapons and stuff don't seem like anything special. I think party add, ooh. Um, okay, all of these people I recognize. So either, either like they didn't give you all of the characters from the first game or I've gotten far enough to unlock all of the characters from the first game before. 56,000 gold pieces? <laughs> oh, 6, 666 gold pieces? Nice. Uh, sure. Let's take Mia. No response. I, I don't think Orca's gonna respond. Yeah. <laughs> what about you, Pyros? Pyros? Okay, we might not be allowed to add anybody right now. That's a possibility. Oh, Black Rose is already in a party. I'm a dumbass. Don't mind me. And Mistral's probably a no as well. Okay, yeah. So no adding anybody. Slide two, you got it, my guy. I don't think you heard me. Uh, are, can you hear me now, Nate? <laughs> are you here? Can you can you listen, my guy? Ooh. Okay, that's how you turn camera. I don't think there's anything in this town that we really care about. I mean, there's like the my shops and Johnny, stuff, but. The stray grunty. I've never seen you around here before. Who are you? That's weird. Um, anyways, okay, Monday, if you're not doing anything, my guy, uh, if you want to come and pick up that chair, because the cats have started to take a liking to it, to scratch their claws, um, so it's gonna be torn up if it doesn't get out of my house soon. So if you're not doing anything, uh, at some point Monday, like, Monday was driving, can do it Monday night or before two, yeah, uh, before two, probably not, <laughs> chances are I'll be sleeping. But Monday night, I can do that. That's not fun. That's not fine. That is fun. I will save and wait. What is... What's this? Oh, this is the bank. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Do we have anything in here? No? Okay. Would have been cool if like they had some, some stuff hidden in there for us or whatever, but... That's like the potion shop and shit. Hello, like Waddle. My name is Waddle, the stray grunty. I like enjoy wandering around here. So like, leave me alone, okay? These grunties are weird as shit, dude. <laughs> I don't think there's anything else to do here in general. Feared as much, yeah, fair. <laughs> is a baby. Daddy. Oh shit. Is our grunty? Uh, sorry, I don't have any food. So, <laughs> you're gonna go hungry a bit longer, little grunty. Suck it, I guess. Um, I hope you don't die. Susie? My name is Susie the Stray Grunty. I just love this town. Why, you ask? <laughs> That's none of your business. I... <laughs> <laughs> Why they gotta make them all so weird, though? Alright. Let's just get the fuck out of here. <laughs> There's nothing for us to do in town here. I don't even care about, like, the actual people. The grunties are where it's at. I just realized that, like, even using the analog stick, it's still just eight-way movement. Like, I'm using the stick right now. And see, it's just like snapping to an angle and moving us that way. Weird. Yeah? Plan up? for the cream cheese? Nope, you can use it if you want, love. 
Uh, word list, I'm guessing. Chosen, hopeless, nothingness. Let's go. <laughs> Hopefully we don't get our ass kicked in the first dungeon of this game. Ugh. It's the outlaw player. Mm. The bracelet, it's not shining. Is that a bad thing? Do we want the bracelet to be shining here? Uh... I can't remember, is it automatic, like, the, the fighting, or do I need to, like, keep mashing X? Run away? Get wrecked? How do we use abilities? Triangle skills? Yeah. Okay, I'm not going to data drain. Like, first thing we come across here. That did more damage than I was hoping for, though. Especially since we have, like, buffs right now. How do we change... Ah, uh, there we go. Overall map. Okay. Oh, that's first person mode. I don't want that. That recenters camera on something? I guess on the direction we're going. Yeah, okay. And then square is skills. Triangle is menu. X is nothing. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Let's start. Options. That makes sense. Movie text? Oh, it's already turned on. Okay. Oh my god. I don't like the, like, that. <laughs> the glitches with the flashes, man. They bug in my eyes. Raining rocks. I'm assuming that's some kind of spell. I just want to get out of here so we don't have to deal with that anymore. Please and thank you. In the dungeon. I mean, we didn't die to the first enemy. I'll take that as a win. It doesn't seem to have changed. I wonder, like how long it took them to make each one of these games like you know number two compared to number one three compared to two etc because like they really haven't changed much have they <laughs> like the game is still basically the same as it was whenever we played the other one like it doesn't look any better it doesn't control any differently like, it's, it's actually just the same damn game. Which is what I expected, given what little I know about the series. But like, imagine if somebody did that in this day and age. How pissed people would be. Like, if Skyrim 6 comes out... Not Skyrim 6, fuck. Elder Scrolls. If Elder Scrolls 6 comes out, and it's literally just Skyrim, but, like with the number six on the end of it. <laughs> you know, with a new city to explore, though. <laughs> like, people would be livid, man. I don't think that'd fly so well. And these mad lads did it three times. Uh, four times, I guess, if you count the first game. I don't remember what well water is. Raging Earth? Raining rocks. Again, I imagine those are spells. Hank, man, I'm glad we came over here, though. There's all kinds of stuffs. Healing potion. That's... I would love more healing potions. I wonder if that uh, little exploit-like thing works. If you really want to waste a shit ton of time, you can just, like, leave and come back in the room. Yeah, dude. And then all of the breakables respawn. So, like, the chests aren't going to with the, the good stuff. But if you just need, like, potions and antidotes and whatnot, you can just do this over and over again. Max out on basic items, man. If you don't have to go to new dungeons or any of that BS, you just reload the same room over and over again. Which, if I was actually, like, playing through the game, grinding through it, then maybe. But, yeah, no. <laughs> Not doing that right now. Let's go. I agree, Black Rose. Let's go. Enough fucking around. 
Let's get out of here. Is there a way to like make the map smaller? No. It's either just like bam or or not at all. That's too bad. I was hoping we could just make it a there wee bit no smaller. Enemies. You know that is weird. I do I do agree. But my guess is, is they just wanted like the intro to the game to be nice and light. You know, not not trying to murder people as soon as they hop into the sequel here. That's my best guess. Although I wonder if we're gonna come across like a boss in the dungeon, in the final room, as per tradition. Wait, were there bosses in the dungeons before? I actually don't remember now. I remember like the item rooms being a thing now, but I don't remember if there were bosses or not actually. I don't think there, I actually don't think there were. Oh my God. I'm gonna have a seizure from these fucking static moments, man. Not really. I'll be fine. Hey, there's the way down. I can't help. I have to explore. Sorry. There's probably nothing in here to, like, actually care about, but... The game could throw a boss or something at us, and then I'd be kicking myself for not breaking open all these bodies of dead warriors that have come before. Smith's Gloves. Ah, an egg. Hello, egg. Another immature egg. I never understood the Glunty stuff. I played around with it a little bit in the first game when I was younger. And I might have looked at, like, a guide on game FAQs or something at some point, but I don't really remember. Regardless, I just never really understood how it works. It has something to do with, like, what you feed them. It's probably, I'm guessing here, because I, I really don't remember but I'm guessing it's something along the lines of like what you feed them changes that big thing is different attributes here. that they have. And then based on whatever attributes they have is what kind they grow up to be or something. Mm. Yeah, I wonder. I'm guessing. I don't know. I'm the one that's asking. Don't ask me. Really. But if it was here, could we win? That's impossible. <laughs> Way to have faith, my guy. Not even trying to, like, give her hope or anything. Just, <laughs> hey, if it's here, do you think we can win? Nope. Straight impossible, my guy. We're both going to die. End up in a coma like our boy Orca. Or worse. So, hope you're ready to die. IRL. Immature egg, let's go. The mouth on that thing, though. It's kind of creepy looking, man. Not gonna lie. Okay, so what do some of these items do that we've got? Healing potion's obvious. Restorative. Okay, that's like Asuna. Well water, though. Increase in targets. Temporary increase in targets. Earth element. Okay. I know what the spray ocarina and fairy orbs do. Excuse me. Yawning. Fuck. Meteor strike. Yeah, these are all spells. Raining rocks, level one. Hero's Diary. I just don't understand. Why would you want to lower your magical whatever? Was it magic attack attribute? I don't remember what it was. Is it like the lower your magic attack, the higher your physical or something? Because I know, like, Pyrrhos, or however the hell you pronounce his name, he uh he's like a tanky guy with, like, a two-handed axe or some shit. So it makes some level of sense if, like, it works like that. I mean, it is his diary. So maybe it's something along those lines? Bro, how are we going straight to the exit, like, every single time? I would say that's, like proof that we're god gamers, but it's not even the way I want to go. <laughs> I want to go the wrong way, damn it. I want to explore. I need items and stuff. And I do wish there were enemies here, but you know what we should do, though? Let's 
speed charm. Uh, fuck Black Rose. Get wrecked, woman. We quick, boys, now! Let's go! Running through this dungeon, man. Ain't no one stopping us. Good thing she, like, teleports to us every time we go through a load zone. Golden egg. Ooh, golden egg. You're different. So our Grunty is gonna get, like, a shit ton of immature eggs and then one golden egg. And we'll see what happens. I don't expect it to be good. This game is so freaking loud compared to the other stuff we've been playing, man. I'm actually gonna, like, go into the menu here. And... Oh. Sound. Turn down the background music, like, a fair bit. Yeah, something like that is more reasonable. And then sound effects down, like, a fair bit, too. Not as much, but... Because, like, I was just looking over at OBS, right? I have the, the thing, like, where I can see how loud things are. And I have a limit set up on it, so it doesn't go over a certain threshold. But, like, it was peaking at that limit constantly, man. <laughs> like, just the background music. And then you have games like Final Fantasy X and Final Fantasy sixteen and shit that just... Not even close. Hey. What? Oh, little jumpy, are we? Aren't you... afraid? Who, me? Hmm. I'm not afraid. No way. Well, all right, I am. I'm scared enough for the both of us. My controller is soaked with sweat. Gross. So what about you, huh? Yeah. To be honest, I'm terrified. But I can't let that stop me now. You're right. Too bad the $5 coupon on Dot Hack Part 1 and 3 doesn't still work. I mean, not that I need it on Part 1, we already have that, but $5 hey, discount on Part 3 would be nice. Yeah. Or like a $100 discount on Part 4, that would be even better. Game's expensive, man. I don't remember how much off the top of my head, but it's it's up there. It's one of the most expensive games on the PS2. Not the, not even close to the most expensive, but regardless. I want to say it's like a couple hundred or something. Go this way, I guess. Honestly, I think it's like worse playing with the analog stick. I think you're better off just using the D-pad. For me, at least, it feels better the than trying to fuck around with the... the the joystick. And the drag. It's like, since the joystick is just eight way anyways, I feel like it's just a less precise D-pad at that point. Ooh, iron anklet. I don't know like what actual level our gear is at though, so. I don't know what's worth equipping and what's not. Oh, damn it, dude, again. How do we make all of the right turns? Oh, okay, well, this one's a loop. A little less uh, impressive, annoying. I'm not sure which one's right. <laughs> but a little less so in this case, I guess. Again, it's probably not actually worth exploring this dungeon. I feel like that's what we're going to find out, is that we should have just rushed for the end. Oh. 
Huh? <laughs> what? What? <sighs> hey, what did I tell you? That is rude. Really, really rude. What Sorry. What do you do? But that graphic on the wall, it... Where? Where? It's my imagination, but it's just that for a moment it seemed to transform. Oh, don't ever scare me that way again. <laughs> it's not funny. Don't you dare smiley at me. Excuse me, but didn't something like this happen once before? Uh, <sighs> yeah. Oh, okay, I confess. I'm just a newbie that's trying to act big and tough, that's all. Go on, laugh at me if you want. <laughs> I want... to ask you something. Now what? You're pissing me off. The reason I'm here is because I want to help Orca. Why are you here? Because... Oh. What? 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 Oh, it's that guy. Dick dude. I come here to discover the cause, and I find you again. Explain. Explain no. my ass. You don't know Explain anything. I already told I like her. the other day. Huh? You did? Now that you know, what's the problem? Don't you understand what we're doing? I do understand. But you need to face facts. With you two involved, things get worse. That's how I see it. Am I wrong? Oh. Are you wrong? You tell me. Man, I hate him. Maybe. Maybe he's just got his own reason, one that's different from ours. It wasn't he a friend of Orca's too? And also, is Black Rose really still Let's a newbie? She's ahead. level 30 with us, like... She may not be, like, uber experienced or anything, but... By level 30, you should have a basic grasp on how, how things work. I wonder it's if there's a level cap on the end. first game. Could you just, like, level to 99 or whatever, and then the rest of the games just be... Nothing. <laughs> I guess know? we can't go back there again. Wait, was that? Oh, well, fuck. <laughs> that was it, I guess. Okay. <laughs> no treasure room, no encounters, nothing. Just. Uh, we got some basic items. That's something, right? And eggs. You we got a bunch of eggs. You the power up campaign, right? It's, it's sure, yes. We had found out that the item we gave you has a defect that won't let you install it. Oh no! We will exchange the item with the Book of Absolute. The Book of Law was exchanged for the Book of Absolute? Wait, what was the Book of Law? Power up campaign? What's that? Is it a key item or just a regular item? I'm guessing it's a key item. Well, damn. Book of Iron? Oh. <laughs> well, apparently none of them work, so... Okay, hold on. Actually, I don't want to... I don't want to read any of this stuff, because a lot of that stuff is probably first game spoilers. Um, so yeah. Uh... You have new mail! That's what I was waiting for. How do we leave? There we go. Log out. Yes. Oh, the item. Yeah, that's like I don't know. <laughs> it seems kind of seems kind of weird, man. So what? Did they just give you that book in the first game? I'm pretty sure I remember getting the book in the first game. But like, so they give it to you, and then what? It just does nothing the entire game, and then we get another one, and again, it does nothing at least so far. Oh, these actually have dates attached to them. 2001, 10, 20 something 14 2000 September 14 okay let's play tag 
Haha. <laughs> Love him. Not really. And wait, what? Depending on the area, the level of the anime. Okay. A lot of the stuff I'm pretty sure we saw, like, really early in the first one. I just want to get rid of all of these new messages so I know when there's actually something new. Just a loser? Soft, solitary, tripansy. Okay. Aw, oh, damn it. What else is there? Ultimate. Twilight of the New God, Pluto's Kiss. Yep, not reading any of that shit, dude. I don't want spoilers for the first game. You have mail. Okay, guess we have to read the email first. It's her. You are the only one I can count on. Uh, me into segments. Okay. Sophie or whatever that thing was called has diced, dissected, has something me into segments to uh, something me. I must m may m make meek meat to be born. Find the stored segment, please. Hmm. I may have the information to cure those in a coma. If you are interested, then come to Soaring Sky Bounded Abyss. Who I'll be is waiting. This? See, the big I ending is they I'll got hacked. Get... Isn't that the big ending for us all, man? IRL. That's how the world's going to end. We're just going to get hacked. Cat toilet? Noodle wants one of them. Well, like an actual... Like, once the toilet train the cats, I guess, is what I should say. Clearing all of the stuff. I hate when it says new in games. Okay, back to the world. Buggin. Can we take anyone we want with us this time? Probably Black Rose, because she's, like, you know, secondary main character. And then... Maybe the healer girl. Whatever her name was. Mistral, I think it was. Yeah. Black Rose. Oh. Oh. I guess we have to go alone. Well, fine. Fuck you too. We should probably save real quick, just in case we die. If it is the Matrix type deal, bruh. 100%. I mean, I don't think like Matrix, you know? Per se. Like, I don't think we're real humans that are attached to a machine to generate electricity for machines or anything like that, you know? But I, I find us being... Oh, wait. Did I save to memory card one or two? Either way, this is taking a really long time. No, slot one. It says right there. Why is it taking so long? Anyways, no. I, I find the possibility of us all being in a simulation to be just as realistic as any other. And in my own mind, at least, I find it more likely, but, like, just like with any other truth to the universe sort of stuff, we have no way of actually knowing, right? Which is what it is. Let's go to... Oop. Which one was it? This one. Not that one. Where's all the other ones we just unlocked? Huh. Anyways, this one. It's only battle level 13. We should be okay by ourselves. The original idea was them using us for computational power. That would make more sense than, like, using us to generate electricity, I feel like. It's like, I understand the world is shit, um, so they couldn't use, like, solar or anything like that. But, like, what about nuclear power and stuff? Surely the machines could figure out how to make that work. Or, so, like, I don't know. Computational hey. power just makes more sense to hey, me. Hey, you! I got a suspicious email instructing me to come here. You get one too? Is that why you weren't answering our text? Those who went into comas. That? Yeah. Hold on a sec. That's weird. Look, I can't gate out. 
Wait, is that the guy that gave us the book? Welcome. I am Leos, the system administrator of the world. You have ignored our warnings and Rude. have gone too far. If the two of you hadn't interfered, then the situation would not have deteriorated. You not only did nothing about the coma victims, but you also tried to cover up that fact. What about your actions? Viruses that were spread by hackers caused a series of problems. If you want to blame someone, blame them. Are you saying that if I blame someone, those who are in comas will awake and return to normal? Then, okay, sure. I'll accuse them all you want. Kazu's still in the hospital. Bring him back. Bring him back to normal. Bring him back. We are currently investigating the relationship between the world and those who fell comatose. We are not twiddling our thumbs, I assure you. We are working I am, on countermeasures. But aside from Ooh. that, to take immediate action to prevent the situation from worsening, it requires that you delete your character. No. Delete it? Why? You should know that your character violates the software usage agreement. Installation of an illegal effect. You do know what I'm referring to. I will leave, leave me yourself, you. bitch. <laughs> Good luck with that. Helba. Leos. Do you want to be one of the lost ones as well? What? I wonder what would happen if the boy performed data drain right here and now. No way, I wouldn't do that. I know. Since you aren't stupid. The stupid one is this pig-headed man. You don't even understand how it works, yet you'll delete it before finding that out. Or do you even possess the ability to delete it in the first place? The boy's character data is so well protected, the system administrator can't even crack it. In spite of the fact that you developed a vaccine and disguised it as a rare item, Deleting those you cannot control is something that a pig head would do. Wait, is the vaccine the um, book? Can I say something? I I'm really confused. don't care what happens to this character data. Hold on! Wait, what do you mean that you don't? It's true. Like I've said before, I simply want to help my friend. And that's all I want to do. Helba, system administrator, I need your advice. What should I do? I'm sorry, little boy, but I don't have the answer to your question. And I'm positive that Pighead there doesn't either. Although... Although... If the design of this world was based upon writings in the epitaph of Twilight, it should provide you a clue. Forget it. Leos. Yeah, what? The code name given to a system administrator. Were you remotely aware that it's the name of the King of Lights that appears in the epitaph? It is? <laughs> Silencing is not the only means of control. Why don't you observe them for a little while longer? I won't take orders from you. Orders? No, I'm only offering it as a suggestion. The net is spread throughout the world. If the problems escalate, can you accept responsibility? It's your decision. Uh, the decision is put on hold. Later, I'll tell you the outcome. Oh, well, damn. <laughs> Till then. Epitaph of Twilight. We haven't got enough to go on so far. I mean, we could um, read the epitaph, I the right? Thing earlier. That'd give us some kind of info, no, apparently. Forget it. Well, so long for today. Basically, one of her friends is in a coma, too. That's, that's what I got from that. Not electricity, but the producers thought that would go over most people's heads. You're correct. They used nuclear for power and humans for computational power. Basically, God showed up and said, you have to play off. <laughs> yeah. I think that plot would have worked better for me personally. But...
I, uh, I get why they changed it. And obviously, I mean, The Matrix is still a, uh, a masterpiece, you know, a classic. So, I wouldn't say they fucked it up or anything like that. But that's a, a cool alternate universe that could have been. And one that I personally think would have made more sense. I do wonder, and I have to believe that someday they will, you know? Figure out a way to use, like, the brain as... Oh, ooh. Body odor minus 18? <laughs> Size 12? How much can you feed them before, like, they grow up? Whatever. Eat all these eggs, boy. But anyways, yeah, like, if they'll ever use human brains as a means for... Uh... Whatchamacallit. So golden egg only increases size. I wonder at what size I actually grow up, grow up. I wanna eat twilight onions? I also wonder like what happens oh, if I wanna eat twilight onions. <coughs> they grow near a very old strange weapon. <coughs> I forget what I was saying. <laughs> I completely forget what I was saying. Oh, uh, whatever. Log out. Let's read that new mail. Quit. And... It's going to be another mysterious message. Message from the admins, maybe? We got news! New Bigfoot sighting. Let's go, dude. Biologist who recently flew to Oregon has announced his discovery of footprints belonging to the legendary creature. Scientists have launched an investigation to determine the validity of his claims, but locals remain skeptical of his findings. Hmm. Leo's conclusion. We will approve of your actions under one condition. We will follow my orders from now on. The world is composed of five servers. Each server has a root town. And the areas that can be warped to is different. These can be distinguished by the first letter of the keyword. For example, to go to the area... That, you must use the Chaos Gate in the root town of Triangle <laughs> Server. <laughs> Even if you know the words other than Triangle, you cannot go to that server, you cannot warp to that area, even if the keyword is registered. Server restrictions on all users have been lifted. You may now go to a uh, bottomless Triangle Server. Select other servers at the Chaos Gate to go to Triangle Zero Bottomless Triangle. Go to Bottomless Triangle and obtain information for players in root town. Be investigating as a shop NPC. When you have gathered the information, talk to me. That is all. Yay! New town! Okay. So wait, we go here. And then... Log in. And from here we go to Bottomless Triangle? Is that... Is that what he said? I can't remember how to switch servers. I'm assuming we just do it, like, here? No? Here. Aha! Other servers. Bottomless triangle. Let's go. Well, shit. So, triangle server would have been the one that we did the first game. Like, whenever we tried the game before. Excuse me. So, this is a new place for me, then. Because I'm pretty sure the first game is locked to just the two towns. the The one you start in, and then the one we were just in. Highland City, or whatever. All right, so he wants us to investigate by talking to people. So, hello, you. Tim. Uh, okay, you'll trade some shit. Don't care. Grunties. Uh, I don't have any food. Hello. Here you can feed the young legendary Grunty. It's always hungry. Please get its food from the areas. Okay, very helpful, I guess. Is this another Grunty pen? No. This is empty. Okay. Interesting, I guess. Can we get other people? Awesome. Okay. So, yeah, I want you and... Uh, or was it Elk that was the healer in Mistral? No, I, I think it's Mistral that's the healer. I don't remember, but whatever. I'll take both of them. Hello. Help me talk to people, people. Fool. I'll trade one. Okay. Useful. Thank you. You're a 
Uh, save. You are... You're not Leos. Scrolls are one-time use only. It's good to buy elements. Don't care. I'm assuming the person we actually need to talk to is going to be, like, obvious. You know, kind of like Mia was in the first one. But I don't know. Ooh. Sad that Hex is disbanding, but it's okay. Thanks for the memories. Favorite band is going to break up. Leave me alone. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. You're a long way off before you can talk to me. Root. Bombung acts all cool now, but the character he has is a special one that he got in an event. His old body was so lame, you'd laugh if you saw it now. Seems like the uh, bottomless triangle server isn't normal. Well, it just shows how strong I am. What does that mean? I've been using Wing these days to buy my uh, me items. It's not that bad. I've been using Wing these days to buy me items. Just say something nice and he's happy. He's like a dog. Still here? What's your problem? Don't you get it? If you get it, then scram. No, I don't get it. Okay. Nothing else to say to me. I understand. Goodbye. Item shop. Talk. It's common sense. Take along plenty of healing. Yep. Okay. Shit. I didn't mean to talk to you again. I'm trying to leave. Uh... Yeah, there's nobody just, like, standing around to talk to. You seem to be playing a lot with girls, but this is an online game, so they may not actually be girls. I'm not bragging or anything, but the girls that I play with is a priestess in real life. Hmm. I get so anxious when I'm in Carmina Gadelica. Hey, I don't have ulterior motives or anything. Whoa, bottomless triangle server is open. Things are going to get interesting. Hmm. You're late. What the? Are you? Yes, it is Leos. I will give you the instructions now. For now. Investigate the rate of infection in Lambda server. Lambda. Surveys of protected areas are top priority. Protected areas? Areas that are officially undergoing maintenance. We have not yet found out what they are. However, we already know that your illegal powers can break that protection. And that you need this for gate hacking. Now, Virus Core P. <gasps> we got P. This is nothing to be surprised about. This is the result of a successful abstraction of the virus incubating in the monster's data. The data codes to the protected area were on the board. Wait, so did we... Did we find it already then? And I guess we didn't actually have to talk to people either, huh? <laughs> that was just a lie. We have new mail. Do we want to read that, or can we just go straight to the protected area? Just check the gate and see. Because we've read all the board messages, unless, like, no area codes are registered. Oh. Well, fuck. Okay, well, goodbye, party. Thank you for running around town with me, and that's about it. Let's, uh, let's check the board. Is this an event character? So a transparent... Okay, Dolores Evil-Eyed Widow. That's probably where we want to go. I like the theory that protected areas open if you fulfill a requirement, like a hidden event. Mm, okay. Test variation of the world. Missing. Haven't seen Red in a while either. Wonder if he's busy. The world is still very deep to me. Uh, lightless distance, okay. Trading convention. Okay, so wait, what was the... I was able to go, I guess they're done. Wait. Not that one. Where's the... Is this an event character? Here we go. Dolores Evil-Eyed Widow. Okay, that's where we want to go. I'll try to remember that. We'll probably fail, but we'll, we'll try. Mail, Helba. It seems a new path is open. I will send you the information on virus cores again. Small size, mid size, larger size. Battle level 30 and below. Virus core A, B, C. Uh, above 30 gives you D, E, F. There are exceptions. Okay, well, thank you. That's very helpful. Log in. Dolores Evil-Eyed Widow. Dolores Evil-Eyed Widow. I 
We got this. Probably not. It's okay. Well, hello Hi. there. Hi. Lo oh. G type no. See. Why is she talking so weird? Huh? Ever since that noise incident, Mia's input system is acting up. I you are at we'll get fixed. Event you ally a knee way where are you go ink? Bro, what the fuck? <laughs> huh? Oh, to a protected area. The one that was on the board? Lambda Dolorous Evil Eyed Widow? I'm going to head there too. Well, Zen. Mia, I'll say it. Doodle, thank you for the five bits, love. Invite us when you're gonna go to Lambda, Dolorous Evil Eyed Widow. We might find aromatic grass. Mia's intuition is usually right. Mia taught you how to hack the gates, so she has a right to go, right? Uh, yeah. Okay, guess we have to take those two. That's fine. Even if we have to listen to Mia's Light, fucked up voice. Zigo. Light Red Zigo, indeed. Uh, <laughs> God damn it. Uh. Word. Oh, son of a bitch. Why is it like double inputting? Hey, there you go, Noodle. You got your giant eyes. You cannot warp to this area. Ha, watch me, bitch. <laughs> Wait, it does it by itself, right? Oh no, I do have to do it? Do we just... Oh, okay. <laughs> that was that was it. That's all we had to do. That was easy enough, I guess. I got worried for a minute, man. I was like, I don't remember how to do this shit. Oh, fuck me. We've been playing for an hour and we fought one creature. I don't know if we should be like hoping for a fight, but I kind of hope there's at least some kind of fight here. Also aromatic grass, I guess. Is it possible to make the UI smaller at all? I'm gonna guess no, but it'd be really cool if we could. No. Why it's just like so big. Can we like... Aha! Okay, we can back away the camera a little bit at least. Any aromatic grass around here? Disease fan kite? Disease fan indeed. Mia. I agree. Disease fan. My favorite kind of fan. That's literally fucking empty, man. Maybe the dungeon will be different. Ooh, there's something. Watch it be a chest. Yep. It's a chest. A trap chest, but a chest. Items! Uh, fortune wire. Oak anklet. Um... That's weapon, head armor, smith's gloves. That seems better than what we have. Um, so it drops our evade and defense using either one of these, but increases our magical defense and evade. I think we'll just keep what we have on. Another one? Monsters? Monsters! Let's go! Get wrecked, red scissors! Oh, can't we, like, change their AIs so they all attack the same one? How do we... How do we do that? Oh. Here we go. Strategy. Union battle. Like, help me take down one at a time, man. Seems like the best way to go about it to me. 
Just because we haven't data drained anything yet, we got to. <laughs> I don't think the virus scores are actually going to be useful to us. But, like... Got to do it, though, man. Virus score B! Let's go. So that was a medium-sized creature, then? Get wrecked. Mia's gonna die. Everybody's on Union Battle, right? Yeah. Um, Operation Law Recover. Rep. Law rep. That's good enough. Union Battle. noise is interesting. Is it coming from the dungeon? No. Where's that noise coming from? Is it this? I know, like, the eggs and things make noise, but... Maybe it is the... Maybe it was the dungeon. I don't know, man. Don't mind me. I'm stupid. Kill the armor! Nice miss, bro. Ow. Ow. Holy shit balls. Uh <laughs> members. Mia. First aid. Bruh, okay. Damn, we are getting our asses kicked. Everybody first aid. Just, yeah, just keep me healed. You guys just do whatever. And just heal the shit out of me, dude. Okay, one down. Mia needs heals quick, though. Okay. She's gonna be okay. Yeah, Ank. Ank. <laughs> yeah, Elk Tank. Oh my god, dude. Okay. Uh, attack. Go back to normal now. Chest? No. Items, fortune, use. Green guard? I don't know what that is. I didn't, I don't remember checking. Like, did it say the level of this gate, this dungeon, whatever the hell it's called, before we came in. I don't know if it did. But I, I feel a little bit like we might be a little under-leveled for it. I'm not gonna lie. Bruh, Elk, what are you doing, dude? Attack. Seriously, is Elk even here? all the way back there. What are you getting experience for? You didn't do shit, my guy. You cast one spell or something, and it was on yourself. Like, <laughs> you didn't help us at all, man. Antidotes. Meh. Another green guard. Bearcat egg. Bearcat egg. I wonder what you do. Pure water. Better than that nasty water, I guess. Uh, hold on. How do I use, like, my skills? Ow. Oh. Dropping reps. Increase target's defense. Drop a fireball on the target. I don't think that was worth it. <laughs> I mean, it did decent damage, but, like, we can get out attacks so quickly. Bruh, she's gonna die. Oh, damn, there's three of them? Bro. <laughs> Bro, we're so screwed. 
Okay, first aid. And, uh... Healing potion? On ourselves. And another healing potion on Mia. Okay, now everybody... Just attack. Or just use your skills even. I don't care. Just freaking kill this thing, dude. Damn, dude, we might need to use Data Drain just to kill these things effectively. Okay. Ooh, they dead. Our SP is really low. Oh, Damn it, dude. <laughs> I didn't realize what kind of thing it was. Yeah, heal me. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, that's probably enough. Uh, did we just go down? I think we're just gonna go down. We'll probably die if we explore too much up here, so... <laughs> I think going down and just getting as deep as we can, as quickly as we can, is probably the best move. Gaia spell. Did you get... Uh, I don't know what that says. I'm not even going to try to decode it. We might as well use some of our items, right? Raining, raging Earth. We have a lot of that, but it's not that powerful. Let's use the Hanged Man. Oh my god, that is slow, dude. That is so slow. Wait a second. I'm not able to move. Why can I not move? That's not what was supposed to happen. I can't do anything. Uh, okay. Okay. Well, that was bad. Did it, like, reflect back onto us? Let's try a level three meteor strike on the Phoenix Queen. Bro, that did not do nearly as much as I had hoped. Just keep healing, dudes. Stone Storm. Okay, this one's almost down. <laughs> Obviously, we should have, like, explored a little bit first or something. Okay, one down. Stone Storm. Um, Gaia Spell. Bro, okay, these things really don't deal much damage to them, do they? I guess it's probably the wrong... Whatchamacallit? Wrong element? Oh, wait, what skills do I have? Fire and earth? What's fire do? Uh, no, fire doesn't really do anything either. Bro, we just suck. That's the problem. Okay, well, we lived barely. tempted to use a spirit orb just to figure out how to get to the end of this place quicker but I think it's just the level that you're on right not the whole dungeon okay uh change tactics for everybody use your skills to just kill these things as quickly as possible now prevent damage by dealing damage basically An elk, if you'll just do literally anything, that would be pretty cool. Devil's Axe? That sounds fancy. Although it doesn't sound like something for us. Okay, this thing's going down quick. That one was easy. Can you, like, stop running? Thank you. Blade. What's the devil's axe? Again, I, probably not for us. 
Yeah, no. Uh, probably for Pyros. Pyros? I don't know how to pronounce his name. Probably for him. We want to go the, this way. Assuming we're just trying to get to the end of the dungeon. It's anything like the first time we came across the girl, though. It could just be find a specific room or whatever, not necessarily the end. Bro, I'm starting to think Elk is literally useless. Has he done anything other than... Okay, no, he did cast a spell on her. I'm guessing that's like physical damage down or something. Or no, that's whatever was freezing her. So these things must cast some sort of paralysis spell. Why you gotta be such a little bitch, Elk? There's a lot of chests in that back room over there. Which makes it kind of tempting, but nah. Moon. Stone Storm. Gaia Spell. We just going. Oh no! Okay. I'm guessing this is. Yeah, it's gonna say where something happens. You look like a boss. Uh, hold on. S not skills. First aid. Wait, am I frozen? Did my controller disconnect? Nope, I was just frozen. Okay. Just heal me. Keep me healed. And then... Skills. Slash at high speed. There we go. Level 2 spell. Holy shit, dude. This thing's got health on it, man. Okay. Everybody use your skills. I'm pretty sure the only way to beat data bugs is by data draining them. But like... We got to get it to a certain point or something first, right? Shit. Resurrect. And then healing potion on myself. And... Uh, Mage's soul. Oh, wait, no. They're both fine. Mia hasn't come back yet. That's why. There we go. Mage's soul on Mia. Oh, there we go. Perfect, dude. Ship the double clicking data drain it. Squash this bug, dude. Get it the hell out of here. Did we get anything like nifty? Nah, just fire score him. Now it's just a regular old thing. Look at him go. Oh shit, my bad. Yeah, 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 yeah. No. That wasn't what I meant to do. I meant to do that. Don't run away from me. I'm trying to murder you. Hey, look at that. Aromatic grass. Wow. Thanks. Oh wait, her voice thingy works now? How do you use that? There's no use for it. We just collect it. Uh, you like wheels of cheese in Skyrim, man. Ah, but futility is a necessity. Wait, seriously, why did your voice box thingy start working again? A system without futilities is very vulnerable. The key in opening a new gate is futility. Just because there's no use for it, is it futile? Sometimes the existence itself is enough. Very hey, philosophical, Mia. I guess. Oh, I guess it got fixed. Yeah. Congratulations! <laughs> Though that was amusing in itself. Elk. <laughs> Wait, we never ran across the girl though. That's annoying. I was hoping to see her again. 
We got aromatic grass, and Mia got fixed, so everything is perfect. About time that guy got fixed. Drop my water bottle. It's fine. The Have a good night, you as well, man. Have a good night. <gasps> Wait, what? It's broke Don't, again. Uh... <laughs> okay. That makes no damn sense, but dude. I didn't see any girl-like character. I guess I'll start again. Are we gonna get new mail now, or anything telling us where to go, what to do? Hmm. Try logging out. It's normally what you do whenever there's like no clue on where to go. New post on the board. There is indeed protected area found. Found a protected area in ta bottomless triangle server. What was it called? Lambda server as well. Anyone know when they'll be done with the maintenance? You probably can't go in, but it was Lambda Nameless Seekers Prairie. Sounds like where we need to go. Epitaph of Twilight. Seems to be popular these days, so I put up a new topic. Epitaph of Twilight is an online work that was on some novel related site. It was popular in certain circles, but the site it was on bit the dust. So I couldn't gather much information about it. Fragments of the text data apparently got traded for a lot of money among the diehard fans. But I don't know if that's true. The entire thing is just filled with mysteries. If anyone knows anything, please post. If it was just like on a website, how did it not just get like printed out? You know what I mean? <laughs> there are some weird parameters known as monsters and items. Those parameters can change the appearance rate of monsters and items from the area level where it's been set. If you use these two well, it gets pretty easy to collect items. The items you can get in an area are directly related to the level, but the enemies get stronger and then it gets pretty dangerous. If you choose a negative word for monsters, the rate of appearance for items in the area will not change, but the difficulty of the monsters that appear will decrease. Also, if you choose a positive item word, you can increase the rate of appearance for appearing items in that area. Increase the rate of appearance for appearing items in that area. Okay. The words that I know are word monsters so bounded is negative 10 to monsters and evil eyed is negative 8 to monsters okay interesting i wonder if there's any way other than like finding those on the board or just looking them up irl i guess of discovering what they are like what negatives they have or positives or whatever Log back in. Uh, what was the... It'll tell us if we just hover over it. The protected area. Lamb does something. I don't know. I don't remember. It's fine. I wonder if we can take whoever we want this time, though. Looks like it. Party! I definitely don't want elk. I want black rose. Hop. Thank you. And... Mistral. I think Mistral's a healer. I don't think we can check that from here. No, we can't. Word list. Nameless Seekers Prairie. That's it. Level 32. We're probably going to die, but it's fine. It's 2.13 in the morning. It's about time for us to get going anyways. What's the worst that happens, you know? Uh, we need two bees? Is there a way to, like, switch it to something else? How do we get another bee? I guess we just had to go extract it from a monster. In that case, uh, random. Level 41. No, let's, <laughs> let's not do that, actually. Um, beautiful. Uh... Wasn't evil-eyed a negative one? Evil-eyed. White devil. Sunny demon. Beautiful evil-eyed sunny demon. Level 37? Level... F okay, hold on. One of these has to be a lower level, right? Chocobo, what's up, man? Summon or two, you got it. 32 is not too bad. Beautiful evil-eyed deadlands. We'll try that one, I guess. It's still a higher level than we are, but it's better than, you know, 40s and shit that we were getting. And hopefully that evil eye does the, the negative on him. 
But we do need... So for B, we need... A medium-sized monster? Or no, wait. If it was over 30, don't they drop... Oh, holy shit, dude. Holy shit, dude. Mistral's dead. Okay. Uh, run away. Uh, <laughs> Jesus Christ, hold on. Why is everybody dying? We definitely shouldn't be here right now. Uh, I need... I think it's scrolls. Speed charm on us. Quickly, quickly. They're coming. Okay. Okay, battle mode off. Cannot use during battle? I thought... I thought... Ah! Why, why is... Battle mode off. No! Why does it keep turning back on? Okay. Gate the fuck out. We do not want to be here, actually. Holy shit, dude. That was... That was bad for us. Maybe we should just go... To a different server. Because if all we need are bees, then, like, in theory, we could go back to the first server, right? Because I'm pretty sure any medium-sized monster will give us bees. As long as they're under level 30 or whatever. Maybe Evil-Eyed was a bad one, not a good one? Level 14. Soft orange melody. There we go. I like the sound of that instead. <laughs> Let's go here. <laughs> Level 14. It's got some nice words in it, you know? It's soft. It's orange. Apparently it's rainy. I hear what sounds like... Uh, well, you look like a large creature. I need a medium creature. Skills. Data drain. Will you give me a B by any chance? Razor. You didn't even give me a virus core. Garbage. Skill issue? I mean, it might be, man. I'm not going to argue with you. But either way, we about got fucked. <laughs> so <laughs> we're just, we're just, you know, nope, nope in the hell out of there for a minute. So medium, medium sized creatures. That's what we're looking for. Uh, you, you look like a medium-sized creature. Okay, don't kill it too quick. Damn you all. Uh, hold on. Is there like a don't attack option? I mean, I guess I could just say first aid. Okay. Data drain. Before it gets like one shot again. Hakugar. I don't want items, dude. I want... I want virus scores. Hmm. Ice storm? That's cool, I guess. Ooh. Good size. Good size. Come on. Break. Break without dying. Okay. Data drain. Bruh. Why does the game hate us? Does, is it just not possible to get virus scores from creatures in the first area? Virus score B. Thank fuck, dude. That's what I wanted. Okay. Gate out. Return to town. Now we get to go die. Because <laughs> that's most likely what's going to happen when we go into this next uh, restricted area. But, you know is fine back to lambda and investigate word list this one Whoop. I mean, it's level 32. Technically, that was, like, the same level of the last one we were just in, I think. Or at least close to it. So, I don't know. We might get fucked, but... We're gonna try. Yeah, we really don't need to see this again. We literally just watched it happen a moment ago. 
Okay, the game insists we watch. That's fine. So wait, when we hack into it, does that make it open for everyone or just for us and our party? Because if it makes it open for everyone, wouldn't that be kind of dangerous on our part? Uh, we probably just want to go to the dungeon and just get through it as quickly as possible. If we were actually, like, planning on beating the game, we would probably want to grind a little bit. Collect some equipment, levels, go to the pool over there, maybe drop some shit in there, see what we get, but... Okay, how bad are you going to be? How fucked are we? Um, not super. I mean, you're definitely hurting us, but... Okay, you know what? We don't want everybody on first aid. We want... Okay, so I guess I have to, like, tell everybody to attack and then... Tell Mistral to first aid? Is that how we do it? Now I just wonder if she'll stay on first aid or if we have to like tell her that every battle. She seems to be staying on it. Holy shit, dude. These things are kicking our ass though. I didn't see what it said. Data drain is out of control or something another. We're probably dying. It's fine. Oh, she's out of magic points already. That's good. Thankfully, I'm pretty sure they go back up on their own. I think. Ooh, chests. Hanged man. It's always somewhat useless shit. Stone storm. Meh. We're just gonna try to rush to the end. Oh god, there's a whole party of them. Uh, ba -ba -ba, Gaia spell! Ooh, that worked surprisingly well. Okay, the stuff inside here doesn't seem as strong as the stuff that was out there. This isn't too bad. I didn't mean to open that chest, I was trying to murder things. Poor Mistral. Oh god, Mistral's gonna die. Heal you? You're the healer! Shouldn't you be the one healing? Seriously, Mistral. First aid. Bruh, like, seriously. What the hell was wrong with you, lady? People, man. Don't play a healer if you're not willing to heal. That's all I'm saying. First aid. Holy balls. You know what? Seems like an excellent time for a... Raging Earth. That didn't do as much as I hoped. Do we have any more level 2 spells? We, we do. Go. Stone Storm. Get wrecked. We, we have a lot of these Stone Storms. Drop them. Oh, poor Mistral Man. Why do all these people, like, swarm you? So why you gotta run away, dude? That's annoying. Stand and fight. Wrecked. Anything decent? Mm, probably not. Get the feeling the game would be a lot easier if we imported a character from the first one. Like, you know, like actually beat the first one and imported a character instead of just starting with the default shit here. Ah, uh, fairies will. Ooh, glad I used it here. This is a big dungeon. Or a big level. 
Nope on that, my guy. I will use a stone storm on you. I will use all my stone storms for all I care. Uh, wait, what? <laughs> why, why did I just use that? <laughs> I don't want to decrease my, oh my God, whatever. My magical attack. Uh, not doesn't mean skill. First aid. Please heal me quickly. Thank you. Or am I? Why am I frozen? Okay. I wish there was like a camera lock on, or just like, a lock on to enemy in general. That would be handy. A great sled dog, huh? How's our data drain? Has it calmed down? It has. I'll just drain this thing. Copper lance. Poor dog. How much way were we going? Was it just straight? No, to the left. Oh, there's a chest too. Hold on. Where? Oh, it's trapped. Make sure we actually use the fairy wire this time. Fortune wire, whatever the hell it's called. Instead of almost dying. Holy tree mail. It is better in everything but whatever that one symbol is. So... And then if I... How do I do, like... Here we go. Change equipment. Do we have anything new for you? No. Nothing for you but Black Rose. Do we have... Nope. Never mind. We have nothing for you either. Unless, like, do we have yeah. to give it to them first? I want... Can I just say I want nothing from you? No. So I'm guessing we don't have to give it to them then. Because otherwise, why would it like... Yeah. Make us take something from them. But will you give us more fortune wires if we give you some... I don't know, man. <laughs> Some antidotes? Two antidotes for... Well, yeah. Oh, wait, no. How do we approve? How do we select start? Uh, what? Oh, okay. You just have to get it full and then agree, I guess. That's fine. Actually, you know what, Mistral, do you have anything? Probably not. Oh, there is a gift option, I guess. Do you use axes? I did not expect you to use axes. I want these fairy orbs, though. Sure, take all the antidotes. That's fine. Don't care about the antidotes. Do care about the fairy orbs. Just one? One great dog sled. It seems like when you're being attacked, yeah, you can't move. There is no dodging. You just have to eat it, man. Once somebody targets you, like, you can't... Oh, I guess you couldn't see the controller there. But, like, <laughs> once you're targeted, you're targeted. You just have to eat it. Is there another enemy? No? How did Mistral take damage? Nobody's even, like, over there attacking you. Guess maybe it's flames just went that far. Ooh. Just three, just three. Um... Sure. Looks like a good time for more scrolls. Stone Storm. Uh, it's only going to hit the one, though. And it didn't do very much. Is there anyone... Okay, so that's Earth. That didn't do anything. Do we have... What does wood do to you? Are you weak to wood? Probably not. You're a fire elemental, huh? Yeah, that didn't make much sense. Water, though. Water would make sense. Uh, of course, like, all of the water hit the other person, so... 
Star Ocean... I don't know what that stands for. <laughs> I'm sure it'll make sense once, like, I look it up, though, on the list. But, like, just looking at it, man, T-T-E-O-T, -E I have no idea what the hell that means. Phalanx got fucked. You want to drop a post? A post? A uh, chest for us. That's what I was trying to say. <sighs> Chocobo, I know you're one of the ones that voted a lot on Pokemon. How would you feel about moving the votes from Pokemon Crystal to Pokemon Red? Yay or nay, if you can hear me, my guy. Because I plan on getting a copy of Pokemon Red real soon from a friend. Um, Taco Tuesday every other Thursday? I mean, actually, that sounds like a pretty good idea. Noodle and I have talked about starting up a Taco Tuesday or Thursday or something. So... Every other Thursday sounds like a good time to have tacos. But anyways, yeah, how would you feel about moving the votes from Crystal to... Yeah, yeah, it'll still be Nuzlocke. Same rules as we Sorry. would have followed on Crystal, just, you Did know, I wake it? on Red, since I have a copy of that, or will soon, and I don't know when I'm getting a new copy of Crystal. You're new, Sheraton. Uh, you have holes in your body, and not just because you've been stabbed oh, repeatedly. No, no, no. He's getting beat up. I feel a kinship. You're fine with that? Okay. I'm going to ask a couple of times over the uh, next little while just to make sure, like, everybody seems okay with it before I do it. I'm going to leave Crystal on the list either way. But, um... But, yeah. It just seems like we'll likely be able to play that a lot quicker, red a lot quicker than we'll be able to play crystal, or red a lot quicker than crystal, whatever. So water TOL, does that mean water tolerant? What, Kite is dead? Kite's not dead. Wait, did I die? Did I get revved? I'm so confused. I see we're out of SP, but... Holy shit, okay, yeah, that attack does a lot of damage, man. Ow. Um so wait, if you're water tolerant, what about earth? You got it done. Nope. Ow. Is Mistra like out of MP? No, she's fine. She's just slacking with her heals here. Do we have anything that, like, increases our defense? I doubt you can be poisoned. Oh, wait. Yeah, okay, miss. Why do I have to heal you? Yell at the healer, not at me. I will give the healer more MP, and then they can do the healing. Oh, damn it. Wait, do you have a rev, Miss Healer? You do, thank God. That seems to eat a lot of your MP though. Let's give you more. Can you maybe like, deal with this thing, Black Rose, so I can data drain it? Cause it's taking a lot of hits and it's not doing anything. Oh, dope. There we go. Perfect. Okay. Triangle. Skills. Wait. That cost? Oh, I didn't realize that data draining cost a or SP. MP? I don't know, man. SP. It's S. A. Oh, shit. It restored the... I didn't know that was a thing. I would have used an item to get our SP back had I known. I hate how it freezes us in place whenever they... Oh, shit. We're dead. Uh, If that goes through. Okay. Ooh, buddy. Using Resurrect? Okay. Thankfully, they have that ability. Just make sure that they keep MP then, I guess. Oh, shit. I'm out of MP now. Why? Oh, because I died. Okay, let's try not to die again. Can you please, like, lose your, your shield? Please. I would really appreciate it if you did. 
There, protect break. Okay. Thank God. His whole syndrome too, yeah. <laughs> That's why we feel a connection with him, man. Because we both have hole syndrome. I'm really hoping I don't get a second hole. The bracelet is shining. Bracelet enhanced by Book of a Thousand. Ryu Book 1 is generated by the bracelet. And we got a new virus score. What does that do? Uh, well, we can't see it. It's probably a key item then. Mm. Ryu Book 1. Oh. Okay. Well, whatever. Jesus, man, it still hurts. <laughs> it just takes damage now, which is nice, I guess, but holy fuck. And it's like resistant to, oh God, we're stuck. I seriously hate the, 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 the inability to dodge. And not inability to dodge because, like, we suck. Inability to dodge because the game literally won't let you move when he's doing an attack. Like, <laughs> See? Like, and we were beside it. It snapped to us and then attacked. So it's not like we can even, like, just stay beside it or anything. It's just luck. Like, is it going to decide to eat us or no? Uh, maybe heal yourself, Mistral. Before you die. This might kill us if we don't healing potion. Okay. Uh, everybody... Use skills. Holy shit, balls. Is this GG? I think this is GG. This is GG. Bro, we were so close to the end of it. Oh, wait. What? Wait, what? Why are you in the way? Are you Mr. I thought in when the you way? died, that was just GG. I guess everybody has to do it. Are you in the way? Are you Mr. in the way? Yeah, that's me, man. I'm Mr. in the way. I'm here to be in your way. Hello. Do you have end? I don't know what that means. I want end. Someone give me in. Are you asking to die? Cause same. Hey, are you all right? No, I don't think he is. Yes, I'm Mister in the way. Nice to meet you. God damn it, Mister. Why did we even bring you? What was that? It didn't look like a regular player. Maybe Leos would know something. Let's go back to the town. Sure, dude. Let's talk to Leos, the guy that tried to delete us moments ago. I mean, it's probably best we work with the admins, but I also don't trust the admins very much, man. Not after that stunt they tried to pull, you know? Now, what was it? Was it the item shop? I think it was. It's either items or... No, because that's the item shop. So maybe it was the weapon shop. Nope, never mind. Wasn't the weapon shop. So it was what is this? Scrolls? Bank? I think this is the bank. Wait, what? Where the hell is he? Did he move? Or maybe it was the item shop and I'm just an idiot. That's a possibility. Bro, okay. Fuck, I don't want to talk to you again. Maybe he moves around. Maybe we have to leave and check our mail. We did get new mail after all. Schools are one time use only. Yeah, okay. Hmm. So unless he's the save NPC, he's just not here. Yes. Fuck, dude. <laughs> Log out. Not even saying bye to anyone. Just logging the hell out. Uh, quit. 
And what's in the mail? Is it useful? Probably not. It's usually not. Oh, hey, it's Leo's. Report the results of your investigations in Lambda Root Town. Well, that's convenient. Bro, wait, what? I can't just reply to you like in the email? This is dumb. The way this works is dumb. Is he going to be the same one again at least? Why wasn't he just... Fuck, whatever. It's fine. It's fine. Oh, he's just here Report this time. Okay. the situation of the protected area. The infection is spreading. There was also one data bug. A player was attacked, so we defeated it. Wait. A player in a protected area? Just now realizing how weird that is? That is probably failed data. They are immune to the protection. Of course they are. But a data bug. Hmm. That's worse than I expected. Two of them, actually. Failed data? So it's not a person? Of course. It is useless, meaningless data. There is nothing more or less. We will initiate the follow-up investigation. I will inform you of your next orders later. So we still haven't gotten to see the girl again. That's annoying. New mail? No new mail. Log out then. Board post. Protected area. Data breach. Went to the area that was protected before. The graphics were funky. Is that the data breach that people were talking about? Anything else new? No. Any new mail now that we read that? Yes. Investigate an area with heavy infection. The keywords are resurrecting resurrecting confused judgment. Yeah, we're not going to do that right now. But are we doing the right thing? I feel like we're just being used by Leos. Uh, nothing we can do. But I don't know what to do. So I guess it's the only option available to us. Yep. There you go. Perfect. Anyways, guys. Uh, I think that's all we have for tonight. They're like a purple one at one point. I don't remember. Anyways, yeah, no, it is, uh, it's 2.42 in the morning. I think that's a good time for us to get off. Dot hack mutation, part two, whatever the fuck you want to call it. It's, uh, it's the first game. But with more areas to explore. <laughs> that's all I got to say about that, really. It's not bad or anything. It's just like I was mentioning earlier, you know, it's kind of crazy that... It really is just, like, the same exact game, you know? Like, the same textures, the same models, continuation of the same story. They really didn't change fuck all about it, which is just crazy to me that they did four games, and presumably that's how it is for all four. But whatever, it's still a series that I want to finish someday. Has been since I was young. So one of these days, one of these days. But uh, yeah, no. Thank you guys. I appreciate y'all coming to hang out. Uh, have a good night and be kind to each other. Bye, y'all. What is the deal? Ooh, okay. What kind of deal? <laughs>